today we will revise plane figures and also learn a little more about them we already know that a plane is a flat surface that extends in all directions now do you remember what plane figures are yes shapes drawn on a plane are called plane figures they are formed by curved lines or straight lines plane figures are of two types open plane figures and closed plane figures let's study both types let's begin with open plane figures look at this curvy line it begins at a point x and ends at another point y plane figures that start at one point and end at another point are called open plane figures curves are open plane figures kids doesn't this figure look like an angle yes angles are also open plane figures now let's look at closed plane figures plane figures that start and end at the same point are called closed plane figures some closed plane figures are square triangle rectangle and circle circle and oval are closed plane figures with curves they neither have sides nor corners the area enclosed inside the circle is called the circular region next we are going to learn about a new term called polygon what do we mean by polygon closed plane figures which are made of three or more line segments are called polygons triangle square rectangle pentagon hexagon octagon decagon etc are polygons four sided polygons are called quadrilaterals some of the quadrilaterals are square rhombus rectangle parallelogram and kite kids do you know a triangle has three sides and three vertices the area enclosed inside the triangle is called the triangular region its sides can be of same or different measures a square has four sides of same measure and four vertices the area enclosed inside the square is called the square region look at this line it joins the opposite vertices it is called as a diagonal a square has two diagonals of same measure a rectangle too has four sides four vertices and two diagonals of same measure and the area enclosed inside the rectangle is called 
the rectangular region. A rectangle and a parallelogram have opposite sides of equal measures. A diamond or rhombus has four sides of same measure. Four vertices and two diagonals of different measures. The area enclosed is called the region of diamond or rhombus. A kite has adjacent sides of equal measures but opposite sides of distinct measures. Wasn't it fun learning about plane figures?